EA Sports welcomes you back along with Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sabalski, set to bring you all the play-by-play. -play. These two teams meeting for the first time here in this series. Ray, a quick thought on this one? Everything becomes magnified in a playoff series. Game one means so much because you want to get the jump on your opponent, but all you can worry about is your shift, your next time on the ice. It is such a fun time of the year to play. Both teams seem ready, and they are about to drop the puck on this opening faceoff. The quest for Lord Stanley's mug continues right here tonight, and we are underway. His reflexes on display tonight. Handles the puck. The Comets moving ahead. Rister, no room for that one to get through. Timmons plays it into the offensive zone. Oh, he destroys them on the play. Colorado's on the attack. Strong defensive effort. The Eagles gain possession along the wall. Taken along the wall by Salamaki. And he denied that opportunity. Really good positioning as he makes the stop from in tight. Can't keep a hold of the puck after that play. Quick pass to tries. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. Gives them nothing in front. High quality chance, high quality save. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. Still scoreless in this one. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. From his own end, he picks up the puck. Gains the zone on the left wing. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Takes the feed. Puts it on net. Stopped by the goaltender. Good job tangling up his opponent here. Feeds the puck to Sherwood. The Eagles have it against the wall. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Sends it in deep. The Comets get a hold of the puck in their own end. Grayovac's got it now deep inside his own end. Moves it around along the half wall. Quick shot. Gets a piece of it with the trapper. Moves it quickly over to Malone. Oh, just wide of the net. It doesn't matter how close it is. If it's not on the net, it can't go in. The Eagles will play it from the defensive zone. Moves it over to McDonald. Aaron pass, and the play's broken up. Utica's got it along the wall. Forces the turnover. Here's a short pass to Malone. Can't connect. Utica's gained possession along the boards. The Eagles have it now. Up along the wing. Takes the puck at the point. Looks to make a play over to Arsenal. The Comets move to the offensive zone. Picked up along the boards by Dickinson. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Slides it over with pace to Wagner. Nice pass. Picked up along the wall by Wagner. The Eagles take it along the wall. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Moves it to Perron. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Stopping the play. That's a pretty good scoring chance. That's a chance the shooter thinks might go in, but the goalie turns it aside. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. Still no score in this one. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Quick feed to Dickinson. Puts it to the front of the net. What a save. He'll probably feel that one tomorrow. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Snatches the puck with the two centermen locked up. Quick pass to Dickinson. That pass goes a little sideways. Trying to get back on the attack now. Along the 
the boards. They battled for the puck back and forth. Moves it quickly over to Timmins. The Comets gain control of the puck against the wall. Fires it into the offensive zone. Colorado's got it from behind the net. And a good use of the body to knock the puck loose. On the attack along the boards. Here's a short pass to Perron. And that goes off a player. Colorado's on the attack. From the slot, wrist shot. Traps that puck tight to his chest. That's a smart read with the two centermen tied up. Nice zone entry from the middle. A little dipsy doodle and he loses possession of the puck. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Past the midway mark in this period. We're still scoreless. Utica's won the draw, and they'll go to work. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Nice poke check. Scoops up the puck now. Colorado's looking to break out of their own end. Pushes it across to Salamaki. Moves the puck along the half wall. Here's a shot. Score! All over the rebound, and he puts it in. It's a long series, but it's always nice to get the first goal of the series. They're in the back of the net first. Colorado's hustle, the difference here as they take a 1-0 lead been so hard to get any open space on the ice. You work, work, work. There's nothing there. Finally, they score and now you can open the game up a bit. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. He sends a pass over and puts it anywhere but the way he wanted it to go. He's got to do something a little better than that. Just can't finish it from there. Wonder if that gives him a nightmare later. Manages to hang on. Moves the puck. Receives the pass. Fired into the offensive zone, allowing for the blue line to change things up. Feeds the puck over to Banks. Into the offensive end now. Puts it on net. Oh, and he misses an opportunity there. Looking to be too perfect. Get it on the net. You've got a better chance to squeak one through the goaltender than if you miss it outside the net. The Eagles carry it along the wall. Tangles him up with the stick, and the officials are all over it. Let's get the call here. And it's going to be two minutes for hooking on the call. A lot of people debate, is this a lazy penalty to hook? I don't know if it's lazy all the time, but it's a penalty of being out of position. Your stick's parallel to the ice. You get called all the time. Here's a first look at the power play. Well, this power play shows up at a rather opportune time. They're trailing by one, and now a chance to level the score off. Aggression will be the key for them. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Colorado's still got time here in this first period to increase this lead. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And puts it just wide. The goalie was late reacting. If that puck hits the net, I think it's in. The Comets will play the puck from behind the net. Handles the pass at center. Graveax the victim of a hook penalty coming up. Great save by the goaltender. Just real smart positioning on that one. Denies him again. And here's the official call as play is whistled dead. The good old-fashioned hook is sending him off to the box. He's almost in the right position, but he's got to give him a little hook. When he gives that tongue, he goes to the penalty box. It gets called every time. The Comets could really open things up with a five-on-three power play. 
What an opportunity here on a five-on-three power play. See if you can get one and two goals with the man advantage. Good clearing attempt to breathe. The Comets get a hold of the puck along the boards. Gaining momentum along the wing. Moves it to Hamilton. Here he is on the backhand. He was locked in there. Smothered that in close camp. Hangs onto the puck. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Utica's got a hold of it against the wall. Lights the lap on the power play. One of the guys skated by as he was starting the power play and leaned over and said, we're getting one here. They're on the board. Is that a called shot? I think it is. Not bad. You make so many decisions that happen so quickly. Every once in a while, you get one wrong. That's an example of a bad decision. Here in the later stages of this period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Stevens has won the draw here in the neutral zone. Utica's got the puck against the boards. Here's a shot, and that one's turned away. The Eagles will play it in their own end. Carries it in. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Made the stop on that play. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. Offense his own face-off, and he wins the draw. Oh, denies him with the save! I think he got the blocker on it! The Comets move it in. Drives to the sweet spot! Made the save on the play. Sharp reaction save. The Eagles move the puck in the defensive zone. And he slides it quickly to Arsenal. The Comets looking against the half wall. Oh, smart heads off play to poke that one away. Freeze was lugging the puck. Sends the pass over. Ref's arm goes up in the air. Looks like we got a hooking call coming up. There's the stoppage of play. Let's see what the officials say. Hooking's the call. This is what yep. they kind of call the lazy penalty these days, yeah, right? It is, but, it, but really, the problem is you're beat and you panic and you're trying to help, and the more you help, the worse it gets. Go sit down. And he certainly dug himself a hole there. Utica's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Well, they've earned another power play, James. Of course, that starts with an offensive zone faceoff. They've had success earlier in the game. They'll want to double up on that now if they can. And the puck is moved to a safer spot on the ice. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. The Comets played along the boards. On the attack, moves the puck into the corner. Slot shot from the point! Misses over the net. He had plenty of time to step into this. He'd like to get this on the net because no matter how hard he shot it, it was up too high. And the puck leaves the zone. The Comets scoop it up along the boards. Here they come up along the wing. Sends it out right in front. Slotted away with a stick. That's the horn, and period number one comes to an end after a very entertaining 20 minutes. Hey fans, we'd like to draw your attention to the far part of the arena where we're welcoming all of our minor hockey kids here in attendance tonight. Two more periods still to come. We'll be right back with much more action here on EA Sports. Both teams are back at center ice, and we are ready to get period number two underway. The Comets take possession, and their man advantage unit won't have a lot of time to work with here. And a poke check knocks the puck away. On the tip, and the goalie somehow gets a piece of that one. 
Bailey's rolling along on his point streak. You know he wants it to keep going. Still plenty of time left in this frame. It's all tied up. Nice job tying up his opponent. Quick feed to Hamilton. Comes up with the block. Keeps control of the puck after taking a little knock. And now it's grabbed by Selamaki. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Moves the puck into the attacking area. Taken by Berchi. With possession along the wall. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Quick pass to Salamaki. Strong defensive effort. Moves it quickly over to Tries. Denies him in close. I like the goalie's positioning here. He was aggressive enough to make a save on a dangerous chance. Those are the saves that are gifts from the goaltender. That looks like an automatic goal. He's able to make the stop. The centermen glide into position. Krajovac's won it in their own end. Slides the puck over. Battle along the boards. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. Moves it to Anderson. From the neutral zone now. A chance denied by the goaltender. Gets a hold of the puck here in his own end. Takes the feed. The Eagles played along the wing. Puck scooped up by Sherwood. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. Takes the pass. Goaltender gave up nothing as it hits the outside of the post and will play on. Well, the deadlock stays, James. That shot hits the goalpost and bounces away. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Lifts the stick and takes the puck. The Eagles take it across the blue line. At center ice now. He grabs the puck. Can't keep a hold of it. Handles the puck. Biggs is tripped up, and we've got a penalty coming up. And here comes the judgment from the official. The Eagles will lose a man tripping the call. Played with fire. He got burned, Ray. Oh, he's digging around for the puck, and sometimes you just get caught. This time the player goes down, and he's got to go to the box. The Comets send their man advantage unit out once more. Sometimes it's just your night, and the way that they've performed on the power play, it kind of feels like they're going to get another one. Colorado's looking to break out, and they get the puck out of harm's way. Utica's got a hold of it along the wall. With some open space at center. Here's a short pass to Merci. Oh, comes up with a stop. More than half the period left to play. We got a tie game. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. And they manage to clear it. Moves the puck to Bailey. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Takes the feed. Just wide. And there's the whistle as he elects to slow things down a little. A pretty good decision here with the play starting to break down in front of him. The setters will glide into the dot. The Eagles get a hold of the puck in their own end. On their heels, trying to clear. And they get it down. Yeah, good communication. They talk to each other. They're in the right spot. They just clear it down the ice. Couldn't complete the play. From the point, looks to make something happen. The Comets squander a golden opportunity to take the lead here. That's a long time to sit in the penalty box when the game is tied and you've just taken a penalty to put your team shorthanded. But he gets bailed out. The penalty kill does an excellent job. The Comets take possession off the faceoff. Nice feed from the right wing. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Utica's got the puck along the boards. Sends it across the ice. Utica's got the puck against the half wall. Big save. The Eagles look to start the transition game. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. Handles the pass in the middle. Slides the puck across. From center, they get into the attacking area. 
Looking to make something happen along the boards. Utica's got the puck along the wall. Oh, he'll feel that one. Nice pass. Moved up ahead here in the neutral zone. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Banks. Colorado's going to play the puck from behind the cage. Looking for space inside the D zone. Quick feed to Dickinson. Here they come. Dumps it in. The Comets gain possession along the wall. Colorado's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Quick pass to Dickinson. Sends a pass over. Puck picked up. He scores! And look who it is who delivers! Oh, it's the young guy. They don't really expect that your young guys are going to carry your team. But he's on the board with his first career playoff goal. He doesn't waste any time getting this puck off his stick. The snapshot beats the goaltender from the high slot. The Eagles have taken a one-goal lead here. Kind of surprising the way it's gone. Pretty fortunate to be ahead in a game that they haven't had much of the possession, yet they were able to capitalize there. Maybe they can get themselves turned. The Comets have it against the wall. Knocked away. Puck grabbed by Berchi. Excellent stick work on the play. And he slides it quickly to Hamilton. Stick saved by the goaltender. Yeah, it's in a dangerous spot. He makes a good save here. Takes a couple of knocks and loses control. Moves it quickly over to Hamilton. Big play inside the defensive zone. Beardsheet's got it against the boards. Good heads-up play in the defensive zone. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. Oh, a clutch save! Had to be sharp. That's a great A chance. Stays with it, and he breaks up the opportunity in front with a poke check. Utica's gained possession along the boards. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Utica's got the puck along the wall. Colorado's got control of it now from their own end. Battling for it along the boards. Scooped up along the wall by Salamaki. Gains the zone through the middle. Let's it go from the slot. Turns it away. Oh, you're not going to get a better chance than that, but the goalkeeper does a great job. Pretty good work on the two-on-one. The defenseman gives the goalie the shooter, and he makes the save. Here in the back half of this period, Colorado's up 2-1, and the crowd has been enjoying this one. The Comets win the draw. Great feed from the left side. The Eagles take over on possession. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Move to the middle. Shot. That goes off the stick. Somehow the shooter got loose in the slot, but the goaltender's equal to the task. That's a good save. We've got a penalty coming up on the play. The Eagles will serve two for slashing. Once he puts up his little token argument here, he's going to circle around a bit and try and regroup here as he goes to the penalty box. Were you box. a haggler? Always. You never think it's the right call. The Comets once again send out their power play unit. They've been trying to push for the tying goal. Now they're going to get an opportunity on the power play. And it's a quick pass to Bailey. And that's broken up. Puck is cleared out of the defensive zone. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. They go on the attack through center. Moves it to Berchi. And that shot dies in traffic. Here inside the defensive zone, they get the puck. And a successful clearing attempt. The Comets gain control of the puck against the wall. Glides along the blue line. Couldn't light the lamp on that. What a chance. Sometimes the puck just doesn't go where you want to finish it. He makes a good shot, but he can't capitalize. Oh, and he had the whole corner. As the goalies have gotten better and better, you have to deliver it quick. Sometimes you just miss. Takes the feed from his own end. And they can't score on the power play. They still trail by a goal. 
Well, that's a missed opportunity, isn't it? A chance to tie. They don't cash in, and now we're back to five on five. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Getting into the later stages of this period, Colorado's got a slim lead. They lead it 2-1. The Eagles take possession off the faceoff. Moves the puck. Here's a shot. Comes up with the stop as he got a piece of the blocker on it. I like the way that he stops this puck, James. Not only does he get in front of it, but he puts it out of harm's way. Utica's got it in their own zone. Looking to set up offensively. Sends it over. Arsenal's got it behind the net. And as he stumbles, he coughs up the puck. Here's a short pass to Stevens. Stopped by the goaltender. This is a quality chance that the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. I wanted another look at this one. I'm sure you guys were all impressed as I was. What a save by the goalie. Play set to resume with the faceoff ready to go. The Comets will go to work here in the offensive zone. Right in front, and that's broken up. Now yeah, puck doesn't get to the net. Good positioning by the defender. Driving right to the front. Grabbed along the board by Salamaki. Pass across to Tries. Moves into the offensive zone. Tries will play into the corner. Looks to set up at the point now. Receives the pass. Still too close to call in this one as the second period comes to an end. Hey fans, don't forget to pick up your team calendars. They're available in section 144 at the team kiosk. The third period is just moments away, and both Ray and I will be ready to bring you all the action here on EA Sports. The officials made his way to center, and this third period is about to go. Barring extra time, the final frame of this one. Here we go. Third period is underway. Ray Ferraro is between the benches at ice level. Ray, we've got 40 minutes played so far. How have you viewed things? The Comets will fight the frustration game as well. They've had the puck a lot. They've controlled play, but they still trail by one. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. The Eagles are clinging to a 2-1 lead. Utica's got it across the line. Quick feed to Tries. And now he moves it quickly to Salamaki. Tries to get the puck over to Anderson. Colorado's in transition. Sends the pass over. Picking up some steam at center ice. Center down in front! And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Loose puck battle along the boards. Streaking into the attacking zone from the right. Utica's got the puck. Quick pass to Berchi. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. Taken by Dries. Quick pass to Anderson. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. And they'll dump it in. The Comets get a hold of the puck along the boards. Takes the feed. Slides the puck over. Colorado's got a hold of it against the wall. Loses his balance on the play. Along the half wall with the puck. Taken along the wall by Sherwood. Shot and makes the save. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Shot stopped by the goaltender. Takes the pass. Puck knocked loose in the neutral zone. The Eagles take it across the line. Nice zone entry on the left side. Can't hang on to the puck after the play. Gilbert's got it in the defensive end. From the right side, they gain the zone. To his teammate, grabs it with the glove. 
The most fun save for the goaltender, the glove stop. I loved making that save in road hockey, the old blocker stop. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. It's a 2-1 game. Colorado's won the faceoff. Moves right to the middle. Pokes it away in his own end. Colorado's got possession here in the offensive zone. Denies it in front. Still lots of time left in the period. The Eagles lead it 2-1 in what has been an entertaining game thus far. Handles the puck. Comes up with the stop. Colorado's got the edge in the shot department. A big reason why they lead here in this third period. Locks them up on the draw as they take possession. Takes the feed, moving in. Utica's on the attack. Takes the feed at the point. Fails to find the open man. Colorado's got it in their own zone. The Comets scoop it up along the boards. Takes the feed. Nice pass. Moves it around along the half wall. Here he is from the slot. Stopped by the goaltender. The Comets take it along the wall. Great defensive effort with the stick. Utica's got a hold of it along the wall. Banks plays the puck. From the backhand in front. Stopped by the goaltender. He's sharp on that one. Nowhere to go for the puck. The Comets gain possession along the wall. Here he is in close. Turns it aside with a glove. The shooter's right in the guts of the ice, but the goalie squares up, spreads out, and makes the save. Well, what a quick reflex stop that is. Great scoring chance. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Off the draw, and a nice job locking up his opponent. Pinned up along the boards, and the puck's knocked loose. Sent into the offensive zone. Utica's got the puck along the boards. Colorado's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Stevens works the puck in his own zone. And he handles a cross-ice pass. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Stevens has the puck against the half wall. Colorado's got it behind the net. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. Good defensive stop with the poke check. And that one's broken up. Feeds the puck to Salamaki. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Salamaki's got it along the wing. Jabs the puck away. Tosses it on to Perron. Nothing doing on that. The Eagles have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Here's an odd man rush. Slides it across. And that one's blocked. Tries to make a move and can't hang on to the puck. A little bumping around, but still maintains possession. Nice dish from the left wing. From point blank. Oh, what a save in front. Oh, great use of the body on the play. Takes the cross-ice pass. Move to the middle. Misses a golden opportunity there. Most dangerous place on the ice, and he can't capitalize. The Comets get a hold of the puck in their own end. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. Puck battle along the boards. Tremendous read as he pokes it away with the paddle. Colorado's got a hold of the puck. Maintains possession. Into the attacking end. Here's the pass. Off the mask of the goaltender. Boy, right between the eyes. But he came out and challenged a good save. Smart read by the defender to come up with it. Couldn't find the intended target. Here's a chance. Wow, goes off mark. Yeah, that's not much of a shot from in that tight. He's got to get it on the net. Here's a shot, and he makes the save. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. 
Big save by the goaltender once again. Really sharp, never loses sight of the puck to make the second save. That's a good stop for him to make. Critical timing with that save as he keeps his team in the game. Colorado's attempt to put more pucks on net has paid off as they lead it in the third. The Eagles win the draw. And now he moves it to Sherwood. Colorado's moving it along the wing. Regains possession at center. Moves it quickly over to Berchi. And now he angles it across to Hamilton. Pokes the puck away. Solid check to slow him down. The Eagles have it against the wall. Gains the zone through center. Burroughs plays it against the boards. Oh, we got a penalty coming up, as you can see that he was slowed down on the play. Official blows the whistle. Let's see what the call is. We got a minor penalty coming up For here. Sure, James. I mean, this call was going to be made. You could see the play develop, and now they're going to have to serve two minutes. Utica special teams have another big opportunity to deliver here. You never really know when the chance to tie a game will come. But now you've got a great opportunity on the power play. From the opposite point. Quick snap and a huge stop by the goaltender at point blank range. Bailey's got the puck. The Eagles will kill off a few extra seconds now. And they move the puck out of harm's way. Utica's got it from behind the net. Great stretch pass as he connects. Takes it to the net. Stones him in front. Aggressive stop out on top of the crease to make the save on a dangerous chance. Now we'll get another look at this. That's a good shot, but the goalie gets the blocker up to make the save. Late goings of this period. It's a 2-1 hockey game. The Comets win the draw. Fires one on goal, and he comes up with it. Colorado's not far from the finish line here as they lead it late in this third. That's a smart read with the two centermen tied up. Puck cleared from the defensive end. Uticus gained possession along the boards. And he connects with the long bomb. Makes a move and the puck hops away from him. Both teams back to even strength here. I get that you're not going to score on every man advantage, but boy, they would have loved to have scored on that one. Well, not much they're going to be able to do about that. The power play failed. Now they go back to even strength. A big face-off here inside the offensive end. The Comets win it. Takes the feet at the back end. Colorado's got the puck along the wall. That's not going to fool them. Grabs the puck. Slides it across to Banks. They've got numbers. Utica's got it along the wall. There it is! His first career playoff goal! He doesn't have to wait very long to celebrate that. That's a great feeling getting on the board in the playoffs. Goalie just can't keep up with this. He's close to the net, but he's still able to have enough room to beat the goaltender. The Comets have even things up late in the third. Does this change strategies now? Oh, for sure it does. Coaches will shorten this bench right down. You might see players going every second shift on the way down the stretch. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Arsenal. Final minute to go here in the third. Great chance in front. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Here in the later stages of this period, we are all tied up in this one. Good job tangling up his opponent here. Moves the puck to the attacking area. Picked up along the wall by Dickinson. Here's a chance right in the slot. 
Sends a pass over. Nice defensive robbery on that. Pokes the puck away. Colorado's got a hold of it against the wall. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Receives the pass. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. Denied that one. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. Utica's won the draw. The Comets have it now. Moves it to Hamilton. Moves the puck. Puts it on that. Makes the save. There's the horn to signal the end of the third period. We are still tied. Feeling hungry? Try our arena restaurant for gourmet dining. With great Overtime is just moments away. With one of our many grill locations on the concourse. Will someone get a chance to put the game on their stick? Overtime looms. Overtime action is underway. Absolutely love it. Strong defensive effort. Referee's hand goes up in the air. We got a delayed penalty coming up here. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Time for the officials to hand out the judgment. The Eagles have been handed two minutes for hooking. A uh, step, a step and a half out of position, and you get called reaching out to try to slow your opponent down. Utica's got a four on three here with plenty of time to work with. What an unreal opportunity it is to win this game in overtime now that you've got the power play. I'd say to be patient, wait for the right shot, but you still have to be aggressive. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Colorado's won the faceoff deep in their own end. Puck moved back to the neutral zone. The Comets have it behind the net. Utica's moving it up the ice. Smart defensive play there. The Eagles gain control of the puck against the wall. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. And that's blocked! Takes a wrist shot, misses the net. Not going to be happy with this. He's got the opportunity to score. Doesn't register a shot on goal. And we got another stoppage in play for, guess what? Yeah, another penalty being called here. McDonald's going off to the box for two minutes. You can almost see the air fall out of the players when they shoot the puck over the glass. They know they've made a mistake and it's going to cost them. Another man advantage opportunity looms. Can they take advantage? Oh, thank you very much. The power play in overtime, the chance to put this game away. You've earned the power play. Now you want to make sure that you cash in. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. Moves it to Hamilton. Now a quick pass to Bailey. Good use of the body to knock them off the puck. Grabs it in his own end. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. And now it's grabbed by Bailey. Here's a short pass to Hamilton. And that one's broken up. Great block there. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. And they get it out of the zone. And where are they headed to, Ray? Uh, time for a change. Everyone needs a little break here. They look a little tired. They get it out of the zone. And they can get some fresh troops on the ice. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. They get it out of the defensive end. The Comets have it behind the cage. Here it is for the win! Here's a chance! Denies him! Oh, I thought that was over! Yeah, so did a lot of people, not the goalie. Wow. He's the guy that counted, too. What a stop. 
nearing the final minute of OT. Game on a stick! Oh, what a save to keep it tied! He had to be on top of his game to make that stop. That's a great scoring chance, and he turns it aside. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. Utica's going to be hard-pressed to find better opportunities to win it than that as they come up empty-handed with the power play. Oh, man, the power play misses here in overtime. The penalty killers can breathe a sigh of relief now. There it is! OT winner! There's the final horn sounding, putting this baby to rest. They've got the lead in the series now as a result of a little OT magic. Certainly puts them in a great spot here. The series go by quickly in these overtime games. While they still mean the same as a regular time game, they feel like they carry a little more weight. Had a couple of these OT winners. I got a couple in one series. They were fun and they're awesome uh, to help your team win a series. In short, you simply have to love playoff hockey. For Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Thanks so much for joining us this evening.